Does your joy of eating make it seem impossible to keep the weight off? Well, that was the case for me too. After each of my three children, I gained weight and I immediately went on Weight Watchers. I lost weight each time until I couldn't keep up with the regime. Eventually figuring out the point system, tracking every single thing that I ate, playing a points game, eating different foods in my family, paying for a membership, having restrictions or feeling like I couldn't eat certain foods. Eventually it all became overwhelming and I would say screw it. And when I said screw it, that always meant the weight would go back up, I would gain the weight back that I lost, that I worked so hard to lose, and I would be in a constant cycle gaining weight, losing weight. I never knew my size. I was never comfortable with the size I was because I was constantly gaining or losing weight. I was constantly dieting or saying, screw it, I'm going to enjoy foods. And the pendulum between the two meant I was in constant decision fatigue, constant diet mentality, and it was overwhelming whether or not I was at a heavy or a low weight. I was always in transition and in mental discomfort about my weight. Back in June 2020, my choice to start intermittent fasting absolutely changed my life and put a stop to this constant dieting or not and feeling bad about it. I finally broke this cycle and I know that you can too. Below are links to resources from doctors, medical professionals, and other experts that I really learned from and think that you could too, but this is an overview video so I'm not even going to get started on those right now. Beyond knowing if I was fasting or not, there are no point tracking, no decision fatigue, no feeling guilty. I allowed myself to adopt the fasting lifestyle, let that be my restriction, and then within my eating window, I always have eating windows I look forward to. The fast is worth it when you have an eating window that you thoroughly enjoy. It doesn't feel like you're depriving yourself. Get to the eating window, enjoy your eating window, and then you'll happily fast so that you can repeat it over and over and over again. I absolutely came to intermittent fasting for weight loss. That was my number one and only objective. Gratefully, I did find it. I lost between 30 and 35 pounds within the first five months. I went from overweight to a very healthy weight for my height, and I have maintained that level or below for over two years. In my weight loss journey and my maintenance, there have been absolutely zero food restrictions. I eat foods that I like every single eating window. Nothing is off limits and I did not ever have a strict exercise routine. I try to be an active person, but it's the same as it was when I was overweight as well. The only change I made was implementing a fasting lifestyle. And over two and a half years in, I have never once thought, I need to end this, when does this end? I only have two weeks left. Never. Anytime I was on Weight Watchers, calorie restriction, diet bets, exercise regime, I'd be looking at the calendar, counting the minutes. When does this end? When can I stop? When will I hit my goal? Knowing full well that the weight would eventually come back. Do I have to fast forever to keep the weight off? Yes, I'm sure I'd have to. But does that feel like a death sentence? Absolutely not. I love fasting. I feel so good. I enjoy my eating window. I enjoy my fasting times. Nothing feels sacrificial or like I'm not living my best life. This video is meant to be an encouragement for you if, like me, you find that weight loss isn't sustainable because you like food too much. I want you to know that intermittent fasting might be the answer you're looking for. It was for me, and I truly believe that every single person should just be open to the possibility that it could change your life as well. I was able to find food freedom and a healthy weight with intermittent fasting, and I believe you can too. I share so much on my channel about intermittent fasting journeys, the food choices, why I choose what I choose, different window lengths longer fast, up days, down days. There's so much and it could be overwhelming at first, but this is an overview video. While I did come to intermittent fasting for weight loss, like so many others, there have been so many non-scale victories and non-weight related victories. And I do share those on my channel as well. If you want my tips on implementing an easy to follow fasting routine, you need to check out this video right here where I share it all. Thank you so much for watching. Ciao down and ciao.